Oh, you guys, there's two cruising right here. Oh my gosh, they're big. Okay, here we go. I got a fish going for it. Fish on. Big carp, big carp. Oh, there, I got him. What's going on everybody? Nick from 618 Fishing here, and today should be a fun day. I'm heading out to my local creek to do some cat fishing, gar fishing, and on top of that, I brought my crossbow to hopefully hit some carp. Well, I have made it out to the fishing spot, and the first thing I'm gonna do is actually get some bait for my gar and catfishing setup. I did not bring any. So to do that, there's actually this little culvert pipe with some standing water. There's some little bait fish in there. So I'm gonna use my net, catch a few of those, and get started. All right, I've got a new landing net. This thing actually extends to like 10 feet. It's crazy big. But I am going to see if I can get some bait fish. I'm not seeing any big ones but I am seeing some bait fish in this little puddle. So hopefully there's some decent ones that, I, that I'll be able to use for my catfishing rod. All right, let's see what we got. All right, there's a few decent ones in there. That should work out pretty good. <clears throat> ah, dang, a little baby catfish just got me. Did not realize there was any catfish in there. Ow, he got me good. Holy cow, you guys. Okay, I got to the fishing spot. There is a group of about 30 big Asian carp. Okay, I'm gonna quickly load up my crossbow and then just shoot towards the group and hope that I hit one. It is a fairly long distance shot for this crossbow. Darn it, I missed. There is a massive, massive, massive carp out in the middle. He is very far away. Okay, I think I'm gonna try taking a shot. Here we go. Oh, way short. Way, way, way short. Oh, you guys, there's two cruising right here. Oh my gosh, they're big. Okay, here we go. No, no. This water is so muddy. There's like two inches of visibility. Check that, there is like half a centimeter of visibility. Okay, I'm not seeing any more carp towards me, so I'm gonna quickly rig up my catfishing and gar fishing rods. All right, I've got my catfishing rod set up over there. I've got my gar fishing rod over here. So I'm covering a lot of water. And then in between there, I'll be doing my bow fishing. Hopefully I'll be able to catch some fish. Dang, I was close. Oh, big one, big one, big one. He is really far out though. This spot is not working out. I've, I've had one bite and the carp have, uh, they're not coming close to the bank, so they may know I'm up here. I'm gonna move down a little bit, see if I can find a better location. All right, guys, I was just packing up, but I'm seeing some fish relatively close, so I think I'm gonna take a shot. Ooh, that was close. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and move spots. Oh, big carp, big carp. Oh, I think I got him. I think I got him. No, it came out. Oh, I had him. The bolt was, oh, my line was chasing after him, but oh, it came out. Darn, that was a big one. All right, you guys, there's a carp cruising this way. I'm gonna wait for him to get a little bit closer and then I'm gonna take a shot. All right, here he comes. Here he comes, here he comes. Oh my gosh. My bolt just broke off. It was wrapped around my handle, no, stupid. All right, I've got a brand new bolt rigged up. Hopefully I'll be able to see another car. I've been out here for a few hours. That was the best opportunity I've, I've had so far. Oh. Something just hit my catfishing rod. Someone's got my bait. Oh, fish on. I have a fish. No way. Come on. Yes. Oh man, I thought I was gonna be skunked. Caught me a little channel cat. Awesome. All right, go ahead and let this guy go. Please don't stab me. I've already been stabbed once. There is really no way for me to get down there. I'm gonna toss him. All right, see you later, buddy. I've been out here for five hours and that was the first fish I've caught. Bow fishing has also been very slow. This water is very muddy. I have about a half a centimeter 
check that, a quarter centimeter of visibility. Hopefully I'll be able to catch something else either with the crossbow or on my catfishing setup. Feels good to catch that first one though. All right guys, here's one right here in front of me. Here we go. Missed. Oh my gosh. I am running out of baits. I have a few minnows left. Hopefully I'll be able to catch a catfish or a gar. Oh, you guys, I got a fish going for it. Fish on. Oh, this is a nice one. Oh, a lot bigger than that last one. Please stay on. Yes. Okay, he's down there. I need to land this guy. All right, this is where the new net comes in handy. Check this out, guys. All right, that's one segment, and that's a pretty long net, right? Check this out. Oh, doggy. We got ourselves a 10 footer. I don't want him to come off. Here we go. Oh. So I stay right up here. Nice and dry, stay out of the mud. Right in the net, there we go. Oh, awesome. Second catfish, guys. This one is a whole lot bigger than that first one. Looks like another channel catfish. Fish number two, and this was five minutes after that first one. So cool. All right, we got ourselves a train coming. All right, buddy, go catch the train. See you later, buddy. It took five hours to catch that first catfish. That second one came five minutes after I released that first one. So it is safe to say that fishing is picking up. Unfortunately, I am almost out of bait. So I think I may run back to that little culvert pipe, catch some more minnows, get back here because uh, I'm feeling pretty good about this spot now. Okay guys, let's go get some more bait. It is about 200 yards from where I'm fishing to that culvert pipe. So I'm gonna hustle there, get some bait, come back here and hopefully catch some more catfish before it gets too dark. All right guys, let's see if there's any more little minnows inside this little puddle. All right guys, I got a pretty good amount of minnows. I'm gonna quickly get back to where I was fishing and rig one of these up, hopefully catch a big catfish. All right guys, so when it goes to rigging these minnows, this happens to be a baby carp, I am just rigging through the, through the lip. I've tried a few different ways. That is what is proving to be successful. That's, what, that's what's caught both of those catfish. All right, here we go. Cow, you guys finally seen a carp for the first time in forever. No, I missed. Darn. Holy cow, that's a horrible bird's nest. Jeez Louise. Today did not exactly go as planned. After seven hours of fishing, I was only able to catch two catfish. I hit one carp with that crossbow, but uh, the bolt came out, unfortunately. So even though I was only able to catch two fish, I still had a lot of fun. If you guys are interested in any of the stuff I was using today, including that crossbow, I will link it down in the description. I had a lot of fun. I hope you guys have enjoyed watching. I will catch you on the next one. Ah, dang, a little baby catfish just got me. Did not realize there was any catfish in there. Ow, he got me good. He got me really good. Here he comes, here he comes. Oh my gosh. My bolt just broke off. It was wrapped around my handle, no. Stupid. <laughs>